Well, a 17-year-old Brisbane student has helped develop a groundbreaking maths theorem that can calculate problems faster than a computer. In between his Year 12 studies, Ivan Zelich has been working on the theorem with top mathematicians in the US, which experts say could be the key to solving some of the greatest unknown mysteries about the universe. Well, we are joined now by Ivan Zelich. His brain can barely fit in his head. <laughs> Ivan, what does your theorem do? And please try to understand you're talking to a man who barely mastered long division. <laughs> Um, yeah, of course. My, um, my theorem has three aspects to it. The first thing is it allows us to understand things about geometric structures in um, not only triangle planes but higher dimensions. And the second one is that it thus reduces calculations. It, um, it's a new method of solving problems that ultimately can reduce a five-paged proof to you know, only four lines with one application. And the second thing is it can be generalised. Uh, to perhaps help us understand the universe through string theory. Ivan, the new theorem is actually quicker than current computer calculations, is that right? Yeah, well, uh, with a computer it could take, uh, uh, I don't know, the five-page proof maybe a, um, a few minutes. This, m some of our problems that we've solved have done it faster than that. It's probably <laughs> even trivial to, with our theorem in a few seconds or so. Ivan, six times six, go. <laughs> Thirty-six. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We'll be back to you in a minute. Hang on. He's right. He's right. I think. Nine times twelve, Ivan. Nine times twelve. One hundred and eight. <laughs> Take your word for it. <laughs> what, what, do you, what do you want to do when you when you grow up with this? I mean, you've got so if you've got a mass brain like yours, you can do anything. You can be literally the stars are your playthings. What do you really want to do? Oh, it's, it's tough, you know. I have so many interests. Uh, I would like to just contribute to humanity in the best way I can. And that is either going to be through neuroscience or perhaps uh, understanding the universe through think string theory and quantum mechanics. Those are my passions. So I want to understand my own brain so that I can improve it because, I mean, your, your boundaries are limitless with your with your brain you just have to figure out how to use it effectively and things like that but hey i um i want to show you something okay i've got the calculator here i'm not sure if you can see it five eight double zero eight can you see that monitor can you see right. where am i going there okay there and if you turn it upside down you'll love this <laughs> one one zero eight boobs <laughs> Yeah. It's it in boobs, <laughs> Ivan. Uh, well, boobs, <laughs> Ivan. Stop it, Ivan, I reckon the world of neuroscience will have you in a heartbeat. Yeah. I'm so excited to hear what you end up doing. And, yeah, I'm sure we will hear about you in the future. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Uh, I mean, he humoured you. Yeah. <laughs> Boobs. You always remember his first pair of boobs. I, I, I think. <laughs> but what an impressive what young, an incredibly young impressive man. young guy. And, and what do you say? F find a passion and follow it. And, and a great message. And, and I, I love that guy. I've well, got a son that loves maths, and I see that, and I go, "You can do that one day." Yep. Yeah, it's funny. The, the stories, you know, we've done ISIS before and all that. You see stuff like that, and it actually gives you hope he that the world, the world might be okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, absolutely. And I thought he boobs as well. So that was the main thing. We're going to take a break.